dear Nigel, I'm writing to you because this is a very hard conversation for a mother beetle to have with her son and I don't want to get emotional. You know I love you, Nigel. You're such a good beetle. I'm so proud of you. I kept this from you as it was so important to your daddy that you didn't think badly of him. I told you your daddy was a scarab. And he was, my love. But he wasn't one of those posh scarabs. He rolled dung into balls. He loved it. He was Mr. Pooh Ball 2002 to 2008 consecutively. He could bury dung that was 250 times his own weight in a night. Oh, he rolled a lovely ball of dung, did your daddy? And he was very high up, which is obviously the ideal place to be when you're in dung. It's very important work, Nigel. It aerates the soil, keeps the flies away from the livestock. It's nothing to be ashamed of. But your daddy had dreams. He wanted to be one of those beetles that gets used in research for metallic paints or microchips. Not just shoving a big ball of poo up a hill. Which was, of course, how he died. Well, he didn't die shoving it. He died when he stopped shoving to wave to a friend on a hill. He rolled for two miles and we found him on the A36. Him and the dung. Inseparable. We all felt a bit flat after that. Good news. They've kept his job open for you, Nigel, if you want it. Sure, it'll be a step up from the journalism. Natural History's Comedy from BBC Radio 4. To hear from more like me, go to bbc.co.uk slash naturalhistories.